Hey guys, how's it going? It's 8 Eric. Welcome back. We're going to check out Miko Rama. Uh, just starting this, popping it in. Looks interesting. Um, I was like, alright, let's check it out. And uh, looks a little quirky. Look at these isometric graphics and stuff. Is it going to be like Captain Toad? A little bit, maybe? A little bit like Captain Toad? Okay, cute little eyeball looking robot. I'm not sure what the main objective is, but it is a nice looking game for sure. Okay, I gotta get to that. That's where I gotta get to. Okay. Um, hmm. Let's see. Do I gotta go there? I do like the, the the aesthetic. It is cute. Can I go in the water? Do I die if I get in the water? <laughs> so basically, you push, you tap A somewhere, and it allows your character to uh to move around. And it does not look like I can go anywhere there. And I guess this also is. Mo this is optimized for touchscreen, of course, but I'm playing using a, uh... Oh, there we go. Drag the circle. Okay, nice. Get to the exit. Okay, cool. So this is optimized for the touchscreen, but it's working perfectly with the Pro Controller, which I'm glad on that. So now I hold that, drag the item across. Oh, nope. Slide the screen. And booyah, biggity bang. There we go. Nice. I'm digging that. Crash course. All right. That was fun. Let's see. Run of the mill. All right. Let's try it. Oh, look at this cute little stage. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and go in. All right. And then looks like. Oh, be careful. Okay, now we're going to go here, and then I guess we'll be able to pull up this. See, so it is kind of like Captain Toad, just, just a little bit. All right, there we go. That was an easy stage. Look how cute and adorable he is, though. Like, very cute little character. I'm digging it. That was, that was a fun, cute little quirky stage. So let's go ahead. We'll go here. Chunk error. Chunk. Aw, oh, chunks. All right, now let's go down. Let's go ahead and see if we can move there. Nope, so an X on the ground means that's not where you end up at. So if we click the door, where's the door gonna take us? Am I gonna end up at the bottom of the level or? Little robot, little robot. Oh, I could also use L and R on the top to move around and I do not see my little robot where are you at little guy you guys see him anywhere I lost I lost sign of the little robot guy <laughs> okay um, is he dead Oh, there he is. Okay, I I could not see him. <laughs> there we go. Okay. So I just clicked around until I found a... Uh, found a way... A, a button that I could push. Alright, so we're going to come over here. We'll move him across. Okay, and then... Yeah, there we go. So it does... It has quirky level design, I'll say that. Not a bad little little indie puzzler type of game at all. Oh, you know, and these were some of the easy levels. Do I have any? I do not have any medium unlock, tricky, hard, and ma oh, you could make your own levels too in this. All right, I'm sold. I'm fucking in. So far, so good, guys. Not a bad little game. Maybe, maybe a, a hashtag hidden gem. I don't know. Uh. Here we go. Come across. 
Let's move the guy over here. Move it down. Okay. Um. Okay. Move the guy right there. Now what? Uh. Oh, okay. I know what to do. Check this out. Move the guy around. Move it. And now we're going to come over here. We'll move the guy back this way. Come across. And biggity bam, guys. Wow. Creative and fun. Not too bad, honestly. So this is Miko Rama, guys, just in case you didn't miss what the name of the of the of the game is and didn't look at the title cuz some reason people don't read titles and descriptions but here we go level up uh okay um oh it's going to be one of those all right up okay um just a tiny hair down Come across this way. Come down. Okay. Now we're going to go back up. Come this way. Just a hair. Okay. Up. Just a hair. Oh no. Too far. Come on, homie. Okay. <laughs> up. mess up did I come the wrong way I think I came the wrong way I think we could come this way bring it up right here come this way bring it come back down up all the way there there we go all right we figured it out that one was the hardest one so far but it was not hard I'm actually enjoying this. Look at this. We still have a buttload of levels just in the easy difficulty to check out. And uh, definitely pretty creative. This one looks like it's going to be a little challenging. Spin out. Okay. Uh, what do we got to do on this one? All right. All right, first let's find the exit before we start doing, getting nuts. Okay, uh, back that way. Go across. Back that way. Again. down all right oh there we go see it's it's quirky it's not it's different honestly like I can't recall ever playing something like this so definitely is a little little different let's bring it down takes a little bit of getting getting used to on the controls but it's definitely oh my god I just knocked my guy around <laughs> oh Jesus I'm off of the map oh no spin walk repeat um, how do I get back on my guy my dude <laughs> God. Well, at least I can roam the rest of the level. Look at this. Wandering around. All right. Anyways, this is Mikarama Unique. I kind of like the uh, 
the abstract look combined with like the cute little robot and the puzzle elements and stuff honestly not a bad little game i think for a smaller indie title that if you like puzzle stuff it's kind of like captain toad a little bit a little bit more simplified but still not bad at all i think it's worth checking out anyways guys thanks a lot as always for watching don't forget to leave some engagement comment down below what your thoughts are or if you just want to say hi and like dislike subscribe if you haven't i'll see you guys on the next one peace out